depressed dolphin, Sarah. I'm feeling like a depressed dolphin now. If they're depressed, if I had only been born taller, if you were a scientist, but you're not a scientist, Sarah. You were the assistant to the director of operations. Me. Go on with your notes. Well, your Eat More Fish campaign isn't going well. I'm surprised, though. Omega-3s and all? I think marketing fucked it up. Catch them, kill them, eat them. It just didn't have enough to it, I guess. But me, I'm being resourceful. We have fish, we've got seaweed, a little rice, a little potato, and we've got a sushi and fish and chip special at the cafeteria. Give me more. No one seems gung-ho over your party for the animals idea. It's party with the animals, Sarah. The animals are going to be partying with us. I told you order big giant hats for the sea lions. I want feather boas. I want Hawaiian lays. Glue a martini glass into a seal slipper and see how much fun that's going to be. As far as gung-ho goes, we don't need any gung-ho around here. We got plenty of gung-ho. Nobody needs it. What else, Sarah? Give me something. Something for the papers. Well, the biggest lobster, 45 pounds and estimated over 100 years old, was caught and released. Released? I can only imagine how much butter I'd have to melt for something like that. Yum. But that's it. That's our idea. Sealand believes in the catch and release system. Catch them out there and release them here. We'll take care of them. Maybe. Sealand makes it easy for the public to come see the animals. Come, people coming through the turnstile, Sarah, that's jobs. Your job. Maybe even my job. Probably not my job, though. But, sir, the suffering. Suffering? Suffering? I'm suffering right now with this. All of this. Now go. Take a break, Sarah. Eat it, sister. Get out of here. Take a break. Oh, and Sarah, if those PETA people call, tell them yes, I did authorize the elastic bow ties for the penguins. Yes, sir. Just trying to class up the fucking place.